Hello children, in this lesson we are going to learn some interesting properties about interior angles of a polygon. As we have seen in our last lessons, a triangle has three sides and sum of all its interior angles is equal to 180 degree. For example, here is a triangle ABC given whose interior angles are angle B or we call it angle ABC. So the sum of all the interior angles, a triangle has three interior angles, angle ABC, angle BCA and angle CAB is equal to 180 degree. Same way for any quadrilateral, we know sum of all its four interior angles, angle ABC, angle BCD, angle CDA and angle DAB is equal to 360 degree, right? So sum of all the four angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degree. So triangle has three sides, three angles and a hexagon has six sides, six angles. An octagon has eight sides, eight angles. Nonagon has nine sides, nine angles and so on. How can we generalize this? that what will be the sum of all the interior angles of any generic polygon. Let's try to revise how we have done for a quadrilateral. Here is a quadrilateral ABCD. From point A we drew a diagonal AC dividing this quadrilateral into two triangles. So it had four sides and by drawing one diagonal it has divided this quadrilateral into two triangles and we know sum of interior angle of a triangle is 180 degree so here are two triangles so sum of all the interior angles of the quadrilateral will be 2 times 180 degree this triangles sum plus this triangles sum of all the angles right this is what we have learned in our last lesson that is 360 degree is the quadrilateral's sum of interior angles a pentagon also we can do the same way from a point A we draw two diagonals because this is the side itself so nothing can be drawn so here is one diagonal and here is another diagonal and as you can see because of this now the pentagon is having three triangles quadrilateral was having two triangles pentagon is having three triangles this is the first triangle this is the second triangle and this is the third triangle so sum of interior angles of this pentagon would be three times the sum of interior angles of a triangle because there are three triangles. So 3 into 180 degree because we know sum of interior angle of a triangle is 180 degree and there are three triangles. So sum of interior angles of this pentagon is 540 degree. Same thing for hexagon. From this point A, if we draw all the diagonals, we are going to find it there are four triangles now in this hexagon. One, two, three, four. So sum of interior angles of hexagon would be four times the sum of interior angles of a triangle because there are four triangles. So it is four into 180 degree, which is equal to 720 degree. But now let's observe some pattern here. Pentagon has five sides. And when we draw a diagonal, it is we are getting three triangles. One, two, three. And five sides, five minus two is equal to three. Hexagon has six sides and we are getting four triangles. One, two, three, four. Six minus two is equal to four. Octagon has eight sides. And we are getting six triangles one two three four five six right so the pattern which we are getting is number of sides in a given polygon minus two are the number of triangles we are seeing octagon has six triangles eight sides minus two number of triangles hence the sum of interior angles is number of sides minus two into 180 degree so in case of octagon it becomes 6 into 180 degree which is 1080 degree so what we have seen children is for a generic polygon 
with n sides if we draw diagonals from a given vertex it will divide the polygon in n minus 2 triangles and the sum of interior angles will be n minus 2 into 180 degree why 180 degree because that is the sum of interior angle of one triangle and and a polygon with n sides have n minus 2 triangles so the sum of interior angles of for that polygon will be n minus 2 into 180 degree let's cross check that for example a pentagon has five sides so n is 5 so it's sum of interior angle would be 5 minus 2 n minus 2 becomes 5 minus 2 into 180 degree 5 minus 2 is 3 3 into 180 degrees 540 degree so for a pentagon sum of all the interior angles 1 2 3 4 and 5 sum of all these angle is equal to 540 degree and for a regular polygon the definition of regular polygon we know each angle is same and each side is of same length because each angle is same we can say each interior angle is equal to sum of its interior angle divided by number of sides right because each angle is same so we can say sum of all the angles a1 plus a2 plus a3 plus a4 plus a5 say for example in pentagon case divided by number of sides which is 5 each of them is same right so for pentagon we know sum of its interior angle is 540 degree we just calculated and number of sides is 5 so each angle will be 108 degree so in this lesson we learned how to find the sum of interior angle of a polygon it's simple if there are n sides it will be n minus 2 multiplied by 180 degree and if it's a regular polygon then each interior angle will be sum of its interior angle divided by number of sides that's all in this lesson children bye bye